Hey Gator fans, I'm Shelby Granath. The Florida soccer team is returning to practice today after being in Orange Beach, Alabama for a week for the SEC soccer tournament. They will try to bounce back from their loss against Texas A&M on Sunday in the championship game as they host the first round of the NCAA tournament. The Gators play host to Jacksonville University on Saturday. I caught up with coach and a few players to talk about the upcoming game. I think this has been a resilient group all year and I think that, um, you know, there's some things that we can really take from that A&M loss and when you lose it sort of makes you look at things a little bit more closely so I think from that standpoint it's, it's probably good for us going into this NCAA tournament because we've had a chance to really examine some things in more detail. It's extremely important that we kind of learn from it but then kind of like not forget about it obviously not forget the feeling of what it felt like to lose because obviously with the tournament coming up like you lose you're out so um, I think in a way it was kind of good that we got a loss before the tournament because now we actually know like what it feels like and that we have the ability to lose like we're, it's, we're using it in a positive way. After we let in the first goal it being tied I think we could have stayed a little bit more composed in, instead of trying to force things on the attacking end and even defensively we were just clearing it out instead of trying to keep it which is something we're really good at. So. I think we can just focus on just playing our game, just keeping the ball um, no matter what the score um, and not panicking. The Gators now know that they have to put that loss behind them quickly. The first round of the NCAA tournament is Saturday and Florida, the number two seed, is aware that teams come into the tournament with a new attitude. Well, I think whenever you're in a one and done situation, it's you know, teams can kind of pull out any tactic they want because it's just one game. Um, they might do something that they've never done all year. They might do something that is completely contrary to what you've scouted. So for us, it's just about more about our preparation than anything. And we're just really excited, excited to uh, start NCAAs. I mean, it's a whole new season. Everybody doesn't have any wins, doesn't have any losses. It doesn't matter really what you've done up to this point. So we're just really excited to start NCAAs. Each team kind of gives us a different challenge. So, I mean, it's nothing new to any other game and how we'll approach it. We're definitely still confident. Um, we're really happy with the season that we've had so far. But like I said, starting with NCAAs, you never know what can happen. So we're just going to focus it one game at a time and just see what happens. This is the Gators 17th appearance in the NCAA championships field. And first up for Florida are the Dolphins from Jacksonville University. The Dolphins sit at 12-7-1 overall, next to Florida's 17-4-1 record. Jacksonville is making its third NCAA appearance, and this is the first time the Gators and Dolphins will meet up in NCAA action. Well, I've always admired uh, Brian and his coaching in terms of the way that he coaches his players. Like, I think that they play a similar style to us, and I think that um, he values possession and he does a good job coaching it. The orange and blue have the advantage of being one of 32 programs playing host to the first round action. It's great to be at home. You know, it was a long week at Orange Beach. It was a lot of fun being there, but it definitely takes its toll missing that much school and not being able to sleep in your own bed. So I think we're all excited about being at home. It'll, go, it'll be good to finally play at home, to um, be in front of our fans and stuff. I think it'll be good. It'll definitely be fun. We love playing at home, um, so it's awesome to have NCAAs at home as well. Being a high seed and getting to host Jacksonville will be definitely a fun game for us. The matchup against Jacksonville University is on Saturday at 2 p.m. at James G. Presley Stadium. For full ticket and broadcast information, check out GatorZone.com. For GatorVision, I'm Shelby Grinnell.